And this is Austin DeMauro, the guy that believed that you can do much more. Someone asked me recently, he said, what is marketing? And I start to understand the dilemma that people go through today because they don't understand marketing. Now, I define marketing as influence. Marketing is nothing but influence. You know why? Because someone can render a service to a point A, and point A will be willing to pay just a hundred bucks. And the same person render the same service to point B, and point B will be willing to pay 1,000 bucks. What makes a difference? It is influence. That person that is doing the marketing, they are actually buying because of you. Like I've always said, they are biting on you. Now, I want you to think about fishing. Think about fishing. When you go to fish, you need three things. You need a hook, you need a bait, then you need to realize the right place to actually put your hook and your bait. These are the things you need. And this is the law of influence. If you must market, you must understand people who need your product. That's one. Then number two, you must have a bait. You must have something to attract them. And that bait is you. Then the hook is how good the product is or how good your customer service is. That is what marketing is all about. People bite on you just like they bite on the bait in the hook. They want to find out who are you. So if you are influential, if you are good enough to attract those people to yourself, I mean you can influence them. You can bring them closer to you. They are going to buy from you. People will only buy from you according to how they see you. If they think that you are a hustler, they might not buy from you. They might just buy from you if they buy from you at all out of pity because you are a hustler. But when they see you as someone who is trying to offer a help, you are trying to render a help to them, they will begin to trust you. That is where your influence starts. So if you must influence people to buy from you, you must understand that you, have to, you need to start with the law of help. You come to them with the men mentality, you come to them with a platform or you give them the perspective or the perception that you are about to help them. Don't ever make them feel that buying from you is helping you. You got to make them understand it, that buying from you is helping them, that you are there to help, that your job is a helping job. So in other words, Marketing is influence, and you must influence people with a helping principle or the helping law. The law of helping is the law of sales. If you must sell anything, you must convince the other man that I am here to help. If I am selling a car, I'm trying to give you a wonderful car, a car that will last, a car that will make your friend to look at you and say, yeah, this is the man. So I am the help guy. So don't call yourself a marketer, call yourself the help guy, because you, when you show up help us come so stop hustling stop hustling if you will sell anything stop hustling stop hacking people you, you you keep disturbing them no 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 provide something for them get them to know that they help guys here yeah. the guy who can help them fix the car the guy who can help them fix, fix their hairstyle the guy who can help them fix their faction problem that you you are a problem solver. You are the fist man, the man who, who is here to help. If you would do that, they will call you to buy anything. You'll be surprised you are selling weaver, you are selling human hair, and they are calling you and asking you to recommend who is going to help them get a car because you are the help guy, you are the help lady. Be the help man. Stop becoming the hustling sales person. Be the help guy. I remember Austin tomorrow, and I'm saying you can do much more.